My name's James. But after I show you how to fight this thing, and to win, you'll be calling me your fairy godfather. This is my lawyer. James. Hello, Dad. But it wasn't enough. We weren't enough. James, you could have taken any case. Why this one? Well, I have another client who's invested in Cindy's case. Who? I was never the type of lad that interested you. Wasn't there? Football loving, rough and tumble kind of son you wanted. I wasn't Nathan. I'm sorry. I wasn't there for you when you were scared and you needed me. But if you come back, I promise I'll take better care of you. Because I miss you. everything for him. I'm like this because of you. Well, Dad was off teaching Nathan how to kick a ball. You were teaching me how to lie and manipulate. I wasn't your son. I was your co-conspirator. And look where it's got you. You have a lucrative job. You have a beautiful house to live in. What it's got me is alone. I may have taken Steve's blood and contaminated those trainers. But according to the police computer system, it's you. I was ready to start a new life. To be a second father to Matthew Jesus. I trusted you! I know, I know. After years of telling myself, never open up. Never let anyone see the real you. Because even the people that tell you they love you will let you down in the end. See, this is what happens when you tell me you love me and then you stab me in the back. I told you there was another surprise. Hmm? It was two years later I found out why so they can see if any of their children are being mistreated at home. That's clever, really. Even back then, I was a competent liar. And then they'll take you through it. Every single time you hit her. And they'll get you to admit you're capable of unprovoked acts of violence against someone you claim to love.